Hey, welcome back, Triple R. Today we're going to take a look at a card game called Dinosaurs vs. Army Men. Got it pretty cheap off of Amazon, so it's pretty easy. Let's check it out. Welcome back, Triple R. Here's card game Dinosaurs vs. Army Men. Easy to learn, fun to play. Two to seven players, made by the Arizona Game Company. Get ready for a fun, exciting new twist in classic card game Slapjack and War. Okay, so I got the idea already. Off of the victory, players quickly put the cards up to the center pile, complete. So those cards are in battle rounds, but stay sharp. You never know when a smack attack card will appear. All right. So there's combining war and slapjack, it sounds like. So I guess the worst idea. 12 minute. It's kind of a specific game time there. 12 minutes. Not 10. Not 15. Uh, not bad art. Simple. Gets the job done. Came out in 2020, looks like. So you have the instructions, it's like half of what's maybe ads for other games. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. We'll say it's just page and it's gonna be like what the dinosaurs do. That's cool. Oh no, it's just little facts about them. You get, to, you get to learn while you play. That's, yeah, I probably should put my mic on. Yeah. Alright, put the mic on. Maybe you can hear me a little bit better. Like I said, you can learn while you play about all these dinosaurs. This is quite a few. So let's learn about so all of them. Let's open up. This other cards must be uh, army men. Uh, let's go with number we know about the stegosaurus, maybe some more lesser known. Time Trom Time Trodon Time Trodon. Alright, the Time Trodon. Was similar to a lizard, it was not a dinosaur but a reptile. It lived in swamps and could run fast. The spiny sail or flap of skin along its back could stand up tall to frighten predators. It ranks number 20 in fierceness. Okay, anyway. So we have a battle round here, so on and so on. Number of cards, smack attacks. How to win. Last player with any remaining cards wins. Okay. So you shuffle all the cards out. Alright, let's take a look at it. I'm not going to read the instructions because like, if you get this, it looks pretty self-explanatory. And like I said, this side is just info. Some more games they make. And this is the instructions here. I do I do want to see the art on this, so let's open it up here. I just bent that card. So maybe use a knife, it looks like. That sucks. Turtle bite. Get your army guys here. I'm not even gonna arc uh Petrix. An army guy. <laughs> so micro raptor. Got like wings. Alright. 
Kenneth, the that guy that we read about. Looks like cars, numbers, dinosaurs, and army guys, but he said there's a, a slap at that card that we're gonna, I assume, gonna stumble upon. Looks like this Jeep or something. The art's not bad. It's very, I mean, it's basic, but the dinosaurs look pretty good. And the army guys look fine. T-Rex. Battle round. Okay, so we got some special cards here. I dropped that one. Smack attack. And click out of play. Card stock. It's very slick. And uh, that one bent pretty easy. So I'm not very impressed with the card stock. Like a dedication to somebody. Uh, customer service, promoting their business. There's nothing wrong with that. The instructions on one card to keep out, which is nice. Yeah, they win a battle round. When a battle round card is played, the player flips the battle round card, chooses allowed to battle either dinosaurs or army men. Making the opposite character for this battle. Make them, making them the opposite. Okay. So, okay, they choose what, what they want to battle. So, I'm player to the left. All players flip card in turn. Place in the next central pile. They flip required army dinosaur card. Player with highest number wins all. Piles of return cards and then a battle round. Well, is this war, like I said? Down the cards. You have not lost the game. You can still harass many players by smacking the smack attack card. Successfully won, remove this pile from card. Remove pile of cards from play. Now it helps in the game quicker. So you're not out of the game, but you can shorten the game by getting rid of the cards quickly. So that's. That's okay, so everyone stays involved. So not a bad mechanic. Not a bad mechanic. Oh, let's check the back here. I lost camouflage, which looks pretty good. Well, this is a probably a fun filler to play. You pop out, it's easy. You're playing war slapjack, and then if you do get put out, you can still play Slabjack. Kind of. Well, hopefully I'll get to play this pretty soon. We'll see. That is Dinosaurs versus Army Men. Um, I think it was $5.99 off Amazon. That sounds right. So, but scoring seven players is nice. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.